lives in a pineapple under the sea. SpongeBob SquarePants! And in yellow and porous is he. Hey everybody, this is 22 Tiger Dude and I'm here to review the Spongebob episode, The Scent of Money, requested by Cartoon Movie Maker. So this episode is about when Mr. Krabs uses Gary. Why does he use Gary? For, here comes the twist, for money. <gasps> oh my gosh, I know, I am just as shocked as you guys. Yes, he's using Gary for money. I am so mind blown. Uh, no, not really. And why is he using Gary? Because Gary's shell has been some kind of magnet. That's all you have to know for this episode. Mr. Krabs being greedy episodes, yeah, they could go either way. An episode I liked that involved Mr. Krabs being greedy, even though Mr. Krabs himself angered me in that episode, is The Krabby Chronicle. Good episode, but Mr. Krabs, not likable. My worst Mr. Krabs being greedy episode is Penny Foolish. I can't stand that episode, it bores me to death, and it frustrates me more than any other ones. And The Scent of Money, I really hated this episode. Not as much as Penny Foolish, but I still really hated it. So my positives with this episode, I'm just going to already say, is that there are certain funny moments, like I enjoyed the moment where Mr. Krabs is pregnant. Gary is his pregnant baby, just so you know, but near the end of the episode, he dresses up as a woman. It was pretty funny. Um, There was a scene where Spongebob painted the Krusty Krab into this western style. I actually really enjoyed that. And there were just a few moments that did make me laugh. But my negatives is that the storyline is crap. It's written horribly. You really cannot stand Mr. Krabs in this episode, and you hate how he is abusing Gary and SpongeBob himself. Another positive I have is that SpongeBob finally stood up to Mr. Krabs at the end, but it took him long enough. He should have stood up to Mr. Krabs at least by the middle of the episode, by the middle of the episode, Spongebob should have already known what's going on. He should already catch on, but of course, he's an idiot, and he just has to listen to Mr. Krabs. I hated how Mr. Krabs treated Spongebob. I hated how Spongebob was listening to Mr. Krabs doing all the stupid chores. Mr. Krabs is just giving Spongebob so it could distract Spongebob while Mr. Krabs is abusing Spongebob's little cute adorable pet to get money. This is how I feel about you, Mr. Krabs. Fuck Mr. Krabs. The episode itself didn't have very good pacing. It just rushed certain moments. Mr. Krabs is at this location, he's at this location. And I also hated how Mr. Krabs, he didn't give a crap if Gary was tired. All he cared about was the money. Oh yeah, and I did enjoy the ending because Mr. Krabs actually got what he deserved. Yes. Thank you for giving us a satisfying ending. The episode is, itself is not satisfying, but at least the ending is. And I did laugh at the fact that it was a magnet. I didn't see that coming, even though I should have, but I did find that surprisingly funny. The scent of money overall is very, very poorly done. I hated this episode. Mr. Krabs, he angered me more and more and more and more. It was just not a very pleasant episode to watch. I'm going to give The Scent of Money a 4 out of 10. I am 22 Tiger Dude. Don't forget that I will always have... Tiger Power!